Let's do it. Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Storytime. My name is Miss Kim. Today I wanted to share with you a book about frogs. Our theme this week is frogs, and I'm going to read you a true story about a red-eyed tree frog. So it is written by Joy Cowley. Its pictures are by Nick Bishop, and it is shared with us today by Scholastic Press. Before I read this book, though, I'd like to share a couple of very interesting facts with you about tree frogs. So first off, here is a picture of one. Isn't he cute? I think he's so interesting looking. But I also brought a little friend. My little friend, Froggy, is named Lollyhops. And she would like you to say hi to her. Could you guys say hi to her? Let me hear you. Oh, that was great. Well, she wants to say hi to you as well. There you have it. Did you hear? All right, well, let's get um, started with a couple of facts about our tree frogs. First of all, I wanted to share with you where the tree frog lives. We live way up here in North America in the state of Ohio. And the tree frog lives way down here in Central America. Do you see how far that is? That's where they live. And they live in the rainforest on tops of trees for most of their lives. The um, tree frog is a very tiny little frog, only about two inches long, so very tiny. She sleeps during the day and hunts at night for food. They love bugs. Can you imagine loving bugs? Yes, they love bugs. So let's go ahead and get started with our book today. Got your good listening ears turned on? Get comfy, because here we go. Evening comes to the rainforest. The macaw and toucan will soon go to sleep, but the red-eyed tree frog has been asleep all day long. Isn't she cute? It wakes up hungry. What will it eat? Here's an iguana. Frogs do not eat iguanas. Do iguanas eat frogs? The red-eyed tree frog does not wait to find out. It hops to another branch. The frog is hungry, but it will not eat the ant. It will not eat the katydid. Isn't he funny? Look at his face. Will it eat the caterpillar? No, that caterpillar is poisonous. <gasps> Something moves near the frog. <sniffs> Something slips and slithers along a branch. Uh-oh, it is a hungry boa snake. The snake flicks its tongue. It tastes frog in the air. Look out, frog! Jump! Look how high he's going. The frog lands on a leaf far away from the boa. Huh? What does the frog see on the leaf? A moth! Gotcha! Crunch, crunch! Crunch. Delicious. The frog is no longer hungry. It climbs onto a leaf. The red-eyed tree frog shuts it, its eyes and goes to sleep. As morning comes to the rainforest, And wasn't that so interesting, boys and girls? I loved that so much, and I learned so much, too. But before you go, I have a little finger play that I'd like to share with you about frogs. So this is how it's going to go. I want you to hold up five fingers like this, and this is going to be your frogs, and then this is going to be your log right here, a speckled log. And they're going to be sitting on the log, 
When the frogs eat, I want you to bring your hand up here for eat. And when they say yum, I want you to rub your tummy. Yum, yum. And then at the end, we're go one's going to jump into the pool where it's nice and cool. And then you're going to say ribbit, ribbit. Okay? All right, I'm going to get my frogs on my fingers. I know you don't have them, but that's okay. I just thought they were fun and wanted to share them with you this morning. So I'm going to put them on my fingers like this, but you hold your five fingers up and we'll get started. This is called Five Green and Speckled Frogs. I'm going to pull my cheat sheet out. Okay, here we go. You ready? Get them up there. Here's my log. Here's my frogs. Five green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. Okay, you got it? All right, let's go from four. Four green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. Good. All right, here we go. Three green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are just two speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. All right, here we go from two. Two green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is just one green speckled frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Okay, last one. One green and speckled frog sat on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. How'd you do? I bet you did great. Good job, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me today for story time about frogs. I hope to see you in person very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.